going on everybody dominic back here with yet another new power video in today's video i will be talking about our 10 amp 12 and 24 volt pwm solar charge controller i will be going over a brief overview applications features as well as setting it up to a pv module and a lithium battery so stay tuned let's crack right into the video okay so here's our 10 amp pwm 12 and 24 volt solar charge controller so let's take a look this is what you'll be getting in the box see right here so you have your charge controller right here and then it also comes with a user manual now let's dive into a brief overview so our 10 amp pwm solar charge controller is a low cost battery regulator with a 12 and 24 volt auto switch for off-grid applications. PWM technology is integrated into a compact design that allows for easy installation in RVs, portable solar, and so much more. Designed with vivid LCD graphics that keep you informed of your solar system and battery information in real time. So now that we've covered a brief overview, of this charge controller, let's take a look at some of its key features. So under 12 volts, it can handle 170 watts of panel power, and at 24 volts, it can handle 340 watts. It is adaptable to many different types of batteries, including flooded, sealed, AGM, gel, and lithium batteries. It has automatic 12 and 24 volt detection. It has smart three-stage PWM charging, which is equalization, boost, and float. It has a full range of electrical protections like anti-connection in PV and battery wiring, load short circuit, battery over discharge, system over voltage, and so much more. So, so we take a look here, you have your screen, you have your ports down here. So right here, this is where you would plug in your PV module. Here is for your battery. And then here's for your load, which this is optional. And then on the side, it has one type A USB port to charge small electronics such as phones or tablets. So now that I've gone over a brief overview as well as the features of this 10 amp 12 and 24 volt solar charge controller, now I'm gonna show you how to connect a solar panel to it as well as a battery. So this is basically what it should look like when everything's connected. As you see here from our solar panel right here, run it into the PV positive and negative. Then in terms of battery, we have our lithium battery right there, plugged in accordingly right here. And so we have our menu button as well as our load button. So we can cycle through See, we're seeing 13 volts from the panel. And when I do this, as you can see, it changes in real time. And then right here for the load, having a, a load um, is optional, which is why there's a button right here. So right now, my solar panel is actively charging my battery. Now, let's say I were to plug something in here I just go ahead and click there and as you can see the battery is now if there was something plugged in the battery would be transferring power to that load but since I don't have a load I'm just going to go ahead and turn that off and as you can see here this will automatically cycle between all your uh, data points super easy super simple um, one important to note when it comes to hooking up your wiring and all that is always make sure that you install your battery to your charge controller first. Don't plug in your panel to your controller, plug in your battery to the controller, okay? Then after that, you can add your um, PV module and then you're all good to go. Super simple and easy. All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed today's video. 
on our 10 amp, 12 and 24 volt PWM solar charge controller. If you have any questions, go ahead and drop them down below in the comment section or on our brand new forum page. Link is in the description. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps us out a lot. Keeps bringing you great and amazing content. Also hit that notification bell to be notified when the next video goes live. Everybody, this is Dominic from New Power, and I'll see you on the next one.